Today what we're going to do is create a USB bootable Windows 7 installer um, so that you can install Windows 7 on a laptop without a CD-ROM drive or a netbook even. Um, so what we're going to do first is uh, run an elevated command prompt. So you can do that by doing right click CMD, run it in the illustrator. And you've got command prompt open there. Um, what I'm using today is a 4 gigabyte USB stick and you'll need a Windows 7 CD. So I've plugged them both in. Uh, as you can see, I've got my USB stick there <coughs> and I've got the CD, the CD ROM drive. Um, obviously, I'm creating this USB stick for my netbook. But you've got to create it on a laptop where you've got a CD ROM. So, um, okay, so first thing we're going to do is type in, um, we're going to run disk part. So just type in disk part and that will initiate it. And then type in the command list disk. That will show you all the drives you've got on your computer there I've got a 700 gigabyte hard drive and a 4 gig uh, USB drive uh, stick plugged in so then we're going to select the USB disk so select disk one make sure you select the right disk uh, otherwise you're going to have some problems so select disk one uh, and then we're going to clean that drive so make sure you've backed up anything you, you need on it otherwise it's all going to go there we go, this part succeeded in cleaning a disk and now we're going to create um, create a partition and set it to primary so that's done that and then we're going to set that partition to active there you go, it's active and now we want to format the disk Format the disk to FAT32 and quick. That's going to format the USB stick into FAT32. It's going to do it pretty quick. Uh, and then we're going to assign a drive letter to it. So type assign and then that brings the USB stick up. Now what we need to do now is um, copy the files from the CD, the Windows 7 CD, to the removable disk. So if we browse to the CD, copy all the files on it, copy and then go back to the disk and paste them in. Um, this will take a while because it's going to obviously copy it from the CD, but I'll skip it forward and there we go, we've copied all the files over from the CD to the USB stick. Um, you can just go ahead and close the command prompt down and you can safely remove your travel stick. And that's it. Um, what you'll need to do now is... Um, uh, plug the U unplug the USB stick and take the CD out um, and you can, all you need to do is set the netbook or laptop to boot from USB you can set that in the BIOS um, if you don't know how to do that then you're gonna have to read your manual uh, for your motherboard um, and then set your set your BIOS to boot off the USB stick and it will pick up the USB stick and um, act, uh, launch the Windows installer and uh, that's it really so yeah okay guys so here we have it um, what we're gonna do here is um, boot off this USB stick that we just created on the laptop and get Windows 7 installed on this netbook here. So put the USB stick in, boot off the lap, uh, the netbook, 
Um, to boot off this particular brand, we've got to press F12, which takes you into the boot menu. I've got USB um, enabled to boot, so you've got to set that to enabled in order to boot off it. So I'm going to select the USB. And it should, there we go. Windows is loading files. So that's it really. You've created your bootable USB um, Windows 7 installer. That's it really. So.